Hey, thanks for joining us today. I think there's a greatly encouraging passage found in Romans chapter 8. It says at verse 15, So you have not received a spirit that makes you fearful slaves. Instead, you received God's spirit when he adopted you as his own children. Now we call him Abba, Father, or Dada. For his spirit joins us, with the joins with our spirit, to affirm that we are God's children. And since we are his children, we are his heirs. In fact, now listen, together with Christ, we are heirs of God's glory. But if we are to share his glory, we must also share his suffering. But then verse 18 says, Yet what we suffer now is nothing to be compared to the glory he will reveal to us later. What a great thought that is for us to think about heaven. I, I, I know that's sometimes out of the pale of what we want to think about because that then references our death. And none of us are comfortable with that idea or thought. But God's leading everything to that one final place, that one final destination where he said, no matter what we go through here on this earth, heaven is so much better. Nothing can compare to that glory. Think about that today. Let that hold you up and encourage you, even in these trying and difficult times, that heaven will be worth anything and everything that we must endure to get to it. Thank you a lot for listening.